Hey guys, it's Sandy. When I find something really good, I want to share it, even if it's something that's a cleaning thing. This is called the Miracle Cleaner and um, it has no chemicals in it, so it's not bad to use, but I'm serious. This truly works. It gets the crud off of showers and your bathtubs like you wouldn't believe. I will post some before and after pictures. It was actually disgusting before, but this really works. But I've made it quite a few times and used it, but it was a learning curve for me to figure out how much to use. So let me just share it with you really quick so that you can make it also. Um, this little thing right here is magic because uh, you don't get your hands wet or anything. You just clean it and it cleans everything up. So vinegar is the first thing. Let's put in two thirds cups. If you hate the smell of vinegar, then um, you can use some essential oils and put in also. Now, a lot of the recipes that I read online was half and half, half Dawn and half vinegar, but I'm telling you, you will have suds for days if you do that. Instead, the best thing is two thirds cup of vinegar, white vinegar, and a third a cup of Dawn. I like this blue Dawn and it's three times, let's say three times the cleaning power. So I put it up to a one cup right there and I'm actually gonna get out a spoon and um, stir it up. So that way, <laughs> I got out a fork. <laughs> but anyway, um, mix it up here so that it comes together. That is it. And like I said, if you hate the smell of vinegar, it really doesn't bother me that bad because the Dawn is in there. But if you hate the smell, put some uh, essential oil in. This is grapefruit. You could use lemon, something that just smells good and just throw it in there. A few drops in there. Not that many didn't come out, but that's it right here. Now you could put it in a spray bottle. I actually have something else in this spray bottle. It's Mrs. Meyers cleaner um, that I use on our countertops, but you can pour it in the spray bottle and then spray it on and let it um, sit in your shower and just kind of get the crud off. Or you can pour it right into this, which is what I do pour it into this scrub. This is just a Scotch-Brite uh, scrub thing. Ooh, the bubbles. It's coming really messy. It's usually not, I do this over the sink. Do it over the sink when you're pouring in because it does make the bubbles. Now it will come out the bottom just like you're seeing, but that's okay as soon as I turn it up, it won't. I have found with these scrubs to put it up to this uh, dot or button so that it doesn't keep coming out. That's it right here. And you have your scrub, you just scrub your uh, shower, the whole inside of your shower. You could do it while you're taking a shower and scrub it and then just let the water um, clean it off and scrub your tubs. The kid's tub was nasty. And I use this and it just brings, takes all the crud, all that soap scum and crud off of um, even the handles too. They're really silver and shiny now. So good stuff right here. Now, you could also just pour this, if you didn't wanna have this um, amount left, I just put this in a, a mason jar and stick it under the sink and have it for later. But it takes quite a lot. Um, we have three bathrooms, so I do our a bathtub in one, a shower in one, and then I do the um, sink bowls also. So I usually use up quite a bit of this, you know, by the time you do an entire um, shower in there. So anyway, uh, two thirds cup of vinegar, one third cup of Dawn detergent, don't do more than that or you're gonna have suds, suds, suds coming all over the place. It really cleans your kitchen sink really good also. Um, this is a good scrub, but it isn't going to um, you know, make marks and leave marks in there and scratches or anything like that. But um, if you didn't want to do this and you just wanted to fill up your scrub brush, your Scotch-Brite scrub brush, Make sure, I've done this, so make sure, put in the Dawn's first in the bottom, and then pour in your vinegar. Otherwise, the vinegar will just come straight out of the sponge and it won't do anything. So just pour it in your Dawn, mix it up with the vinegar. Um, if I was doing it, I would do the same thing, about two thirds of it as uh, soap, and then the rest of it as vinegar. Fill it up to there, and you've got your natural cleaner that works like no other cleaner that you're gonna buy in the store. All right, my hands are soapy, I'm dropping stuff now, but that's it, I'm out.